Welcome back to another episode. Oh, oh today we're going fishing and this girl's waiting patiently. So let's go. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, nice. So we are on the Fitzroy River. We're um, camped up in front of the fresh water though, which is good because you know, I've got fresh water for um, dodge and washing and washing up and yeah, random bits and pieces really does help. Makes me main source of water go a lot, lot longer. But um, today we're gonna jump on the quad and we're gonna head back towards the salt. Feels like a bit like we're on the water again, going from the fresh to the salt. Ah then, that's boogie. Blue tongue lizard. Shitloads of them out this way. I just come across this nice little spot. How cool is this? Nice little camp. Water on your front doorstep. I can't get over the amount of bait in here. Take this down for a looks. She's not that deep, but I'm wondering if that um, big tide will end up coming up here. Because if it does and if it comes up a bit, oh, it'd be a nice little hole. Put some nice snags up that end. And she's deep. Well, it's a big hole, so it got a, you know, a couple of metres of water come through here. I don't know, I'm not sure about this system, but if it does, that could be a pretty... Pretty neat fishing spot along here. Well, we're gonna keep going up. I can see more and more water as we get further up, so we'll see what it's like up there. See if we can keep following it along. Now <laughs> yeah, we're talking. Coming across some deeper waters now. Good stretch of it too. Nice snags. A lot of mullet getting around. Beautiful looking snags out there. So I'm not going to throw a line in on the way to where I'm going, which I don't know where that is, so I'm just driving. But um, I'm going to drop a few points and I'll have an idea of where to come back. This is the sort of spot, because I'm, I'm a little bit away from camp now. Bit of a hike. But um, <coughs> this is the kind of place that I would love to um, throw all the camping gear on the quad and uh, head out here for a night or so. Bit of a 24 hour thing. This is nice. <laughs> this is what we come for. Yay, the West Kimberley. Now we're really starting to get close to that mouth. Closer. Probably still a long way away, but just that breeze. It feels like it's that real ocean breeze coming through the river. Just the smell of it. Might even have a little flick around here, I think. We've just come a little further up from where we were. Shady spot for the girl. Oh, I think I got one. Little bubba. Oh, bloody catfish. You're kidding me. <laughs> oh, 
falls hungry. shark smashing up over in the background. I hope it's not a bloody shark. I think it is though. Oh no it's not. Oh. Oh f <laughs> It's dragging me where I don't want it to. No. Oh. That's not cool. I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> oh. It's wrapped around that. No! <laughs> Bloody thing wrapped me around that. Keep the tension on him. It's not running again. Nope, speak too soon. It's not going up or anything. coming back. It's coming back. So it's gone and wrapped me around this bloody snag and it's gone that way. Let's see if I can bring it back. Oh, now it's gone out that way. It's not jumping or anything so Thought if it was a shark, she would have bit me off by now. Oh, it needs to come back and hopefully it'll untangle itself. Oh, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it off. What is it? Get it away from that snag. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. It's a bluey, but it looks oh, nice salmon. Hey. Oh. <sighs> Cut. It's not a bad effort, guys. That was only 20 pound litre. Well, um, you see, I left it like that because it was set up, but it swims good with them smaller vibes, too. The old 40 pound just sometimes can be a bit too stiff, but we'll give it a go. Hey, just after all that going around them snags, around that tree, to get him right up and then lost it. Unbelievable. Wasn't meant to be, eh? There's another one out here for me. Might even be a barra. I cast that one right out then, before. To hook that one. So I might just show it out a little bit further. Instead of just around the snags. Give this spot a go. See how that snag goes.
We got one. Oh, it's a bar or two. Yeah, yeah. Oh, don't speak too soon. I got him on that little vibe, so. <laughs> Pretty deep edge here. Come on, mate. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> I'll bring him up here. It's a bit shallower. Keep it tight. Here we go. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We have our barra. Oh, we have our barra. We've got to measure him up, but oh, it's got to come close. It's going to be a brilliant size for me. Look at the color of this beauty. So it did, it went 57. Only just, but that, you know, for one person, I'm gonna get a couple of meals out of that. Oh, thank you. Well, we decided to wait around for this tide to start coming in. Didn't take long and it just started roaring. <laughs> it's a pretty cool sight to see. I think they're about 11, 11.3 11 meters at the moment. So, good sized tides. And then we thought we'd throw out a livey. And it got smacked. Let's go. What is this? What's happening? I'm gonna spill me. It's gonna spill me. Fuck. Coming. Whatever it is, it doesn't want to come. So I'm thinking, that was back home. Either a big shovel nose or, I don't know, is there, um... Well, it bit me off. Doubt very much it was a shark, it just went, so... Who knows them? You know what? What are they? Swordfish? That thing was going, and that thing was not stopping. Good news is, got on my line back. <laughs> oh well. Well, that just topped off the day of the Arvo. Not bad for coming out here. Wanting to see how far I could make it. Have a look around. See if there's any other camp spots. Show a line, and I even go home now with some fish. So there's a good chance I'll be having fish and chips for tea tonight. Seriously thinking about um, putting the swag on this quad and coming out here, I reckon. Spending a night. We'd love to do a night session here. We'll just be here for a whole 24 hours and fish. 
Anyway, we got probably, I don't know, about an hour or so to get back to camp and head off. Big, get back to camp, clean everything up. Oh, I feel it, that fish, you can um, half tell, eh? I have been for a shower. <laughs> Them flies are good, aren't they? Ah, then, we're gonna jet back. We see he's back at camp. Oh. I'm sweet I doesn't love the smell of rain. How good is this after being out fishing all day in that sun too? Not much, but just enough to sit in, sit under. Right, I'm out of here. I've got to go play in it. <laughs> oh, oh yes. Oh, I thought that tightened up. seen it go down but it didn't take off it just sat there so he's well and truly swallowed it and it is a barra oh yeah it is <laughs> oh no he just bit me mm -hmm. 